All right, on the Raise 3D Pro 2, we're gonna show how easy it is to swap out a reel um, on your dual filament. So we're just gonna swap one. I just did it just a second ago, but I'm gonna show you, it's, it's really easy. We're gonna go to Utilities. We're gonna go to, let's just say we're gonna swap out the left nozzle. We're gonna go to Unload. Um, it's gonna build up from whatever temperature it was to 235 once, once it reaches 235 press unload uh, button to continue unload what it's going to do at this point is it's going to feed filament through and then it's going to back it out you want to at that time pull this tube back about yay far so as you can see it's it's, it's feeding filament down and then it's feeding filament up and it's gonna you'll feel it coming out and ta-da now we're gonna we're gonna cut that yucky little slime bit off of there just snip the end of it just to get that little yuck out I've already got a new reel in there so we're gonna pretend that we didn't so we're gonna if we were we would take this out both reels feed upward this way so this reel is gonna come this way this reel going to come this way and you feed them up into those little suckers there which feed through here everyone's used to these type of coupler fittings goes in the tube just feed it up the tube until it comes out of there and we're going to hit okay because it's done now we're going to reload it so we're going to hit load luckily we're already at the same temperature so we don't have to wait for it to build the temperature up to 235. So we're gonna then put this back in there. It doesn't go very far. Um, once it's down that point, click load, and you're going to feel it starting to feed. As you can see, my finger's going towards there, and we're gonna start seeing fresh filament come from the extruder here. It's a long throat from here all the way down to here. So it takes a takes a second to feed all that through. And we're gonna make sure that the little feeder tube doesn't get back over to the runout sensor. Your runout sensor is right inside here. When it runs out the little red dot comes on and it shuts everything down but we've got filament in both so we're fine. We're gonna wait excuse the noise but I've got my robos running in the background so we got filament coming out here so we can see we got a good stream so we're gonna come back up here we're gonna put our tube back in and we're gonna hit OK and it will stop feeding like it has just pull the excess out of the way and throw it away and then of course you're gonna put your top back on you're gonna close your side door and you're done simple 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 super simple